Hi everyone, welcome back. I hope you're having a great week. For today's video, I wanted to break away from theory and tech briefly and talk about something big and important that's coming up in the R world towards the end of this week and most of next too. And that's Earl. Earl, for those of you that don't know or haven't been before, is the enterprise applications of the R language conference. In other words, London's annual R conference. Now this year, of course, it's being run slightly differently. Sadly, we're not all gathering together in our hundreds at a London hotel, and unfortunately there's no spectacular evening event to enjoy, and I promise you that Mango Solutions do usually pull out all of the stops for the evening event. We've been to places like Tower Bridge, the Crown Jewels, even the Imperial War Museum after dark with war-based actors and all. But all of that aside, at least we have a conference to go to this year, albeit virtually. And I'd like to start by thanking everybody at Mango Solutions, and in particular their marketing and events coordinator, Laura, for making this happen. So why should you make time in your schedule to attend this year's conference, aside from the fact you can literally do it from under your duvet? Quite frankly, you'd be mad not to. And of course, you wouldn't want to miss me doing something that I really love, as you know by now, talking. Joking aside though, here are my five main reasons why you should go ahead and book your ticket to Earl now. I've been fortunate enough to attend every single Earl since the conference first started in 2014. And without word of a lie, each year I've taken an idea away that's helped my clients or some of the businesses that I've worked with from theories and reproducible analysis, to Markov chain media attribution modeling, to topic models. There's always been something that's made me think, I know where I can use that. Unfortunately, this year, there won't be as much scope for networking with some of the incredible speakers. But if I know the R community well, that won't stop any of them from wanting to answer your questions behind closed doors. So via social media, or even over a virtual beer. Mm. There's another thought. You can't have Earl without a beer. Make sure you've got one to hand, although maybe wait until after the keynote to crack it open. The second reason is staying on the pulse, on the pulse of the R community. At the end of each year's conference, I always sit down and think to myself, what does it all mean? No, not life. I'm talking about what has this year's conference told me about the R community in terms of what people are focusing on and where it's heading. And every conference has had a theme. In the early years, it might have been something really simple, like a clear divide between ggplot2 and plotly users for visualization. Whereas more recently, there have been deeper topics like the shiny year or the R in production year, as I believe it was last year. As an R enthusiast, it always helps me take a health check of the community. What are others up to? What should I be looking at over the next 12 months to make sure that my skills don't lag behind? Thirdly, you'll meet some R experts. Okay, we're sadly not going to the pub afterwards this year, unless of course you can find five other attendees that live close enough to you for a well-deserved post-conference pint. But that shouldn't stop you from making new connections. Perhaps to some of the presenters. I, for one, always love hearing from passionate R people. Or you might want to connect to one of the workshop leaders or a keen participant. You can often find that from chatting, you can help each other out too. Perhaps you have a challenge that they've solved previously, or potentially you can offer a solution to theirs. More importantly, all of this will give you a friendly face to talk to when we can finally get back to in-person meetups. Reason number four is that it's a steal. When we meet in person, it can cost a few hundred very worthwhile pounds to attend Earl, and a few hundred more if you want to join one of the expertly led R workshops. This year, each workshop session doesn't even break three figures and you can follow along at home without having to navigate London's tube network or the lift schedule of Tower Bridge, which saves you even more time and money. The presentations themselves are even more of a bargain at 9 99 and this for me is where the real learning happens, looking at what others in the community are doing and getting ideas to take back to your workplace the very next day. 
Finally, and as we all know at the moment, black data lives matter. So, I'm not going to get all political and talk about diversity and inclusion here, but we're all aware of their importance more than ever following the tragic death of George Floyd earlier this year. Now, not only are this year's tickets for Earl incredibly reasonably priced, but all of the profits are being donated to Data for Black Lives, a movement of activists, organisers and mathematicians committed to the mission of using data science to create concrete and measurable change in the lives of black people. I'll put a link to their website in the description below, and of course I'll put a link to the website that allows you to buy your old tickets below. Not only will you be getting expert R knowledge at a fraction of the usual price this year, but you'll also be helping to do some good in the process. That's it for today. Before I finish, here's a quick recap of why I think you should attend Earl. Number one, you will learn something new, something to take away and try with your clients or in your businesses. Secondly, it will help you stay on the pulse of the R community, understand what you should be focusing on for the next 12 months. Thirdly, you'll meet some R experts. Okay, it'll be virtually this year, but you should still have the chance to meet new people and hopefully network in the not too distant future. Fourthly, it's a steal, a fraction of the usual price for Earl tickets and representing really great value for money. And as if that isn't enough, finally, you'll be doing some good in the process with all of the proceeds from the conference going to Data for Black Lives. I hope I've managed to convince you to join me and the other speakers and participants there. I'm speaking between 11.30 and 12 on Friday the 16th of October and would love to see your faces on Zoom to talk to you about how you can use R to optimise your email marketing journey. Do get in touch or comment below if you plan to be there and I'll keep an eye out for you. And of course, if you have any questions about my talk or any of the work I do, feel free to contact me using any of the social links in the description below or at the end of my video. Thanks very much for watching and see you all soon.